everybody, welcome to Chinese Pod. I'm Joy. And I'm Joe. Today we are going to talk about question styles in Chinese. There is one question style, which is the normal question style. We have a statement and you turn that into a question by just adding a ma in the end. This is not what we are going to talk about today because we are going to talk about a question style that is equivalent to the English whether or not. So like whether or not you want to do something, whether or not something is okay, whether or not something is expensive. Right, and in Chinese it sounds like this, hao, bu, hao. Mm -hmm. So there's a word, the word bu, and then that word is repeated. So listen for these sorts of phrases in the dialogue. Let's go check it out. Hao bu hao. Hao. 老板,你们的啤酒好不好喝? 好喝 薯条好不好吃? 好吃 贵不贵? 不贵 先生,你到底要不要点菜? Laoban,你们的啤酒好不好喝? 好喝 薯条好不好吃? 好吃 贵不贵? 不贵 先生,你到底要不要点菜? Laoban,你们的啤酒好不好喝? 好喝 薯条好不好吃? 好吃 贵不贵? 不贵 先生,你到底要不要点菜? Okay, now that we've seen the dialogue, let's break it down line by line. 老板,你们的啤酒好不好喝? Boss, is your beer good or not? 老板 你们的啤酒好不好喝? Boss, is your beer good or not? 好喝 It's very good 好喝 It's very good 薯条好不好吃? And your fries, are they good or not? 薯条好不好吃? And your fries, are they good or not? 好吃 They are very good 好吃 They are very good 贵不贵? Are they expensive or not? 贵不贵? Are they expensive or not? 不贵,先生,你到底要不要点菜? They are not expensive. Mister, do you actually want to order or not? 不贵,先生,你到底要不要点菜? They are not expensive. Mister, do you actually want to order or not? So right before the dialogue, you asked me 好不好? And I answered you 好. So that question was actually, is it, is it good or not? And we heard that in the dialogue as well, right? In the first sentence, what was it? Oh yeah, so the first sentence is, 老板,你们的啤酒好不好喝? So it's interesting that you mentioned that because 好不好 can be a standalone phrase mm -hmm. as whether something is good or not, or is this okay? Mm -hmm. So if you say, mm, let's go to the dialogue, 好不好, so is that good? And he says, 好. But in this case, it's followed by a verb, mm -hmm. 好不好喝, uh -huh. so is it good to drink? So we know the subject of the sentence is the beer, so 好不好喝 follows, is that good to drink? And then there was another verb, do you remember what it was? I think this is about the fries. 好不好吃? Mm -hmm. So you can say, 老板,你的薯条好不好吃? Like, are your fries good or not to eat? To eat. So is it, is it good to drink and is it yummy? Mm -hmm. What else could you have like with 好不好 plus verb? 好不好笑? 好不好笑? Is it funny? 好不好听? 好不好听? So just a note that this adjective needs to match whatever that subject was. So were the jokes funny? Mm -hmm. And was the music good? Mm -hmm. So you have that matching of adjective and subject. So what's the music would be like? 音乐好不好听? Yeah. Okay. 音乐, music? Mm -hmm. 好不好听? Was it good to listen to? Okay. So the answer to these kind of questions for example, like 好不好喝 or 好不好吃 could be 好喝 or 不好喝 or 好吃 and 不好吃 Okay, so the customer wants to know whether or not it's expensive and he says 贵不贵 So we've moved on from the structure 好不好 but it's the exact same structure with two words on the side and 不 in the middle and 贵 means 
expensive. So 贵不贵 is expensive or not expensive. Exactly. And we can do that with like many other adjectives, or pretty much every adjective you can imagine. Or hello. We are so glad that you're enjoying this video so far, but you're not getting the full lesson here. The full lesson and the rest of this video are available on our site, ChinesePod.com. Give it a try and see how much more we have to offer. We have exercises, expanded examples, vocabulary, and downloadable material. You cannot get that here on YouTube. So visit our website today. Enter Grace as the promo code and get 20% off our premium subscriptions. I'll see you at ChinesePod.com. But hurry! Only the first 300 subscribers are allowed to redeem this deal. Use promo code Grace for 20% off your entire premium subscription and launch your real learning experience. ChinesePod, ChinesePod.